The Australian Curriculum Technologies Foundation to Year 10 comprises two subjects, design and technologies and digital technologies. Both subjects provide opportunities for students to create solutions, develop a range of thinking skills, including systems thinking, design thinking and computational thinking, learn how to manage projects and consider how solutions that are created now will be used in the future. The Australian Curriculum Digital Technologies comprises two strands, digital technologies, knowledge and understanding, including digital systems and representation of data, digital technologies processes and production skills, the skills needed to use digital systems to create digital solutions. It's really important that Australian students learn about digital technologies. As the world moves towards a digital economy, where education, health, all aspects of life moving towards digitisation, it's important that Australian students learn how to use and develop digital technologies in order to participate fully in the digital world. So there are two dimensions to an education in ICT. One aspect is where students will learn some general capabilities about how to use and apply ICT knowledge across a broad range of uh, domains. The other aspect is where students will learn deeper skills in the digital technology subject. The design team and writers in the Digital Technologies Group were acutely aware of the need to make the curriculum future-proof from the beginning. The Digital Technologies curriculum has been designed around some key concepts that are applicable now and into the future, such as abstraction and data, which will continue to play a part in digital technologies as the future develops. Technology is always going to be changing and I think a core characteristic of the curriculum uh, is that it's based on a framework of thinking. So computational thinking is a problem solving methodology. It's a way of taking a problem, pulling it apart, looking at what's important in the problem, being able to abstract out of that problem some of the key elements and then devising a solution that can actually solve a problem. Primary teachers have always worked holistically in classrooms and this curriculum provides the opportunity for strengthening that integration across all of the different learning areas. For example, a teacher may set up a digital project where children are interviewing families um, and creating, capturing images of their grandparents and creating a project around his, his historical events or they might be creating a newsletter but they're designing something for a specific purpose and this creates many opportunities for invigorating the curriculum for teachers and for the children to go forward um, in a way that connects with the future but it allows them to do really exciting things in the moment. Every student is going to find themselves in a situation in a workplace where they're going to have to contribute to or be involved with a group that is developing a digital solution to a problem in their workplace. Therefore, every student needs to be able to develop the knowledge, skills, disposition and concepts to be able to be part of that part of their workplace in our Australian society. A strength of this curriculum is that it focuses on collaboration, it focuses on communication, um, always looking at developing a solution where they use their creativity and thinking um, and the management of the project is core and important skill that is uh, put across in this curriculum. So the digital technology curriculum develops transferable knowledge and skills that can be used in the students learning across curriculum areas through to their personal and professional lives when they leave school. Multimedia is taught across a range of different subjects in the Australian curriculum. Digital Technologies focuses on the technical aspects of multimedia where students will use programming and scripting software in order to create and develop and automate multimedia works. Multimedia can also be a focus in design and technologies where students will work to a brief to create a product that might communicate a message, such as an advert for a product. The focus in media arts is on developing creative works where there is aesthetic value and creative vision.
The curriculum is an exciting um, curriculum. It's got real vision. Um, it moves beyond just learning specific skills but gives a clear idea that there is thinking and structure and framework that we need to build on. And I think it has um, real promise for our students for today's world and also the future.